Today, we're going to take you through our range of welded pipe fittings, including bends, tees, reducers, stub ends, caps, and socket weld fittings. Pipe fittings come in different shapes and sizes to suit your pipeline configurations, and are used to join it together to transfer the liquids. All pipe fittings stocked by the metal company are 316 grade stainless, and produced to the ASME B16.9 for butt weld and ASME B16.11 for socket weld. We also stock all pipe fittings to suit either Schedule 10 or Schedule 40. Most of our fittings are available from 15 nominal bore right up to 400 nominal bore. First up are our bends. We stock pipe bends in 45 and 90 degree formations from 15 nominal bore right up to 400 nominal bore. Bends are used when you want to change the flow direction. Tees are available as equal tees or reducing tees. Tees branch off a line so you can direct the flow elsewhere. An equal tee has three outlets the same size, while the reducing tee has a smaller offshoot to reduce the flow into the branch. These are our reducers. We have both concentric and eccentric reducers. These are used to increase or decrease the flow in the pipeline. Concentric reducers are shaped like a cone, hence the name concentric reducer. Both ends of the concentric reducer are on the same axis, so if you're looking at the reducer head on, you can see the smaller section is formed in the direct centre of the larger side. Concentric reducers are the most common style of reducers that the metal company sells. Eccentric reducers reduce the pipe to one side. They have one side that is straight and the other side is cone shaped, causing the centre line being offset. If you're looking at the reducer head on, you can see the smaller section is against one side of the larger side. These are useful on horizontal lines to ensure the line can drain properly. Our pipe stub ends are used with a flange when joining to other pipework, pumps and machinery. Stub ends consist of a short length of pipe with a flared end that flanges can butt up against. They are welded directly onto the end of your pipework. An advantage using stub ends is you can rotate the flange to align with whatever you are bolting to, rather than having to line bolt holes up before the flange is welded on. Weld end caps are used to finish the end of a pipe run. They act as a seal to the end of a pipe. Then we have our 3,000 pound socket weld fittings. These work by pushing the pipe inside the fitting and then one single weld around the outside, which can make for a faster, easier install. We stock socket weld tees, 45 and 90 degree elbows, round caps, couplings, unions and valves. Lastly, we have our schedule pipe in schedule 10 and schedule 40 which the fittings I have spoken about so far allow the pipe to create configurations in the correct directions for the flow to move through to where you want it to go. The metal company can provide material certs, or also known as test certs, for all pipe and fittings. Just make sure you request these at the time of your order. If you have any questions about any of the pipe fittings, please get in touch with our crew for more information, or visit our website, because we make buying stainless steel easy.